What's going on guys? This is Josh the Non-Alcoholic. This is a no booze review. I'm excited about these guys today. We got the McKellar in the house. Gotta pay a little bit extra for these, but they're amazing. I've, I've had their IPA before as well, and I, and I love it because it seems like they really geek out on what they're doing. And I love to geek out on this stuff. This is the Raspberry uh, Flemish style beer. And just this packaging, it seems like everything they do makes me feel like, oh, look at that, look at that. I just, just, I just did a little poor imperfect crack. It's okay, we're gonna get through this together. Nice, nice and bubbly, it's what I wanted. Okay, so those first notes are pretty tart. But it, I, oh, it just makes me like salivate a little bit, just looking forward to it. Yes. Oh. Oh, it's super aromatic. Is that because it's still on my nose? Oh, that's great. It's tart, it's a sour, and I'm so happy about it. Kind of makes you like, pucker up a little bit. Like it's really sour, in a, in a good way. Mm. Oh. Like you know when you get one of those raspberries that's a little less ripe, and it's just extra tart? I love those raspberries. Raspberries is one of my favorite fruits, berries. Are berries fruits? Fruits or berries? I love raspberries. This is delicious. I like it too because it's not sweet. It's just the tart end. It also seems really fresh. There's no like off flavors like it had been sitting on a boat or an airplane or something for a long period of time. It's just, it's, it's real. Oh yeah, and then the, now the malt's coming in in the middle there. It's like you can tell it's a malt beverage, but then like fruit, raspberry, sour. You like your sours, you're gonna love this. Man, I don't, no real off flavors of this because they're coming out of Denmark. This is the Limbo series. Raspberry malt beverage, highly recommended in their category. Give these guys a, let me give them a, give them a 9.0. Good job, McKellar. Stoked, can't wait to try your other stuff. This is Josh, non-alcoholic. That was a no booze review.